a KQED HD production. My name is Simon Christen. I am from Switzerland originally, but live in Oakland, California. My day job is I'm an animator at Pixar. I think I became interested in photography because it's in a way like the exact opposite to animation. You're focusing on a split second in, in time. And just make sure that that one frame is really interesting to look at and kind of tells a story within one frame. Recently, I've become really interested in uh, time-lapse photography. Time-lapse photography is when you use a still camera to capture multiple pictures in a time interval and then eventually stitch them together into a video. We're hiking up to the top of uh, Corona Heights in San Francisco. I'm trying to capture the moon coming up behind the city, but I think since it's already two days past the full moon, it's gonna be slightly south of the city. You need some kind of movement for, for time lapse to become interesting and hopefully it's a movement that when you speed it up that that's when the movement really comes out. I remember this one time the fog was just kind of coming towards the Berkeley Hills. Th there wasn't really anything all that special about it. It wasn't until I went home and put it all together that it became apparent that it was like this really nice fluid motion, like almost like waves that kind of hit the the beach or something. It was, it was really a very fluid motion that I've never really realized before, that that's how fog moves. With time-lapse, the beauty of it is that you can sit up in the hills and watch the light change, and you capture this on camera. If you just have a curiosity for what's going on around you, that's really what it comes down to. You have the curiosity and you go and experience stuff for yourself. That's, I think that's where really the fascination is.